Hi guys, Lisbeth here. Time for another midnight declutter. I think the, I hope you can see me in that. Uh, it is 11, 18 in the evening. The Sunday after Thanksgiving and the place is a mess and I need to work on it, but that's not what I plan on working on. Well, I should. Um, a lot of it is just dishes that need to go in the refrigerator. That's like some leftover Thanksgiving stuff that I'm just going to pitch because I only like to keep my leftovers for three days. And this is the drink I'm drinking now. It is cranberry juice and Sprite, like half and half. So, what I want to focus on... I gotta take this back. I picked up the wrong ink. I don't even know if they take it back at Staples. But here's what I want to focus on. My husband, we just had his 70th birthday party last Sunday, the Sunday before Thanksgiving. And then I had everybody over for Thanksgiving. So this, that used to be my junk drawer that I cleaned out and became the utility drawer has just become the stash and dash mess because people are coming and I don't have time. So let's see what we've got in here. Uh, back here are matches, that's fine. My bottle opener, I use these, it's like a rubber thing. So that's still okay. This is like my timer tape, uh, Listerine thing, that's still okay. Tissues, sunglasses, extra keys, still okay. More sunglasses, an extra door opener, because we only have one car. That's okay. Uh, my measuring tape, I just used that because we had put up a second table and I needed to buy a tablecloth. Okay, groceries. What is Can I see? 11, 19, 17. So after this video is over, I am going to go through these coupons and throw out the old ones because it's past November 19th. I'm not sure what day it is today, but I know it's not November 19th. A couple pins, that's good. What is this mess here? What's it? Small kid toy. Okay, I don't need that note any longer, so I'm going to chuck that if I can pick it up. So that's chuck pile. Okay, so here is my long sheet that I write grocery lists on. I get these for free like in the mail with stuff. I don't ever buy those any longer. What's this say? Tab broke. Tiny bits is sticking out. Remove for sound. This was from Halloween. I have a book that opens and it goes, <laughs> tasty. Um, so it's a spell book and I put candies in it. So that just told me that there was still a tab sticking out, you know, where the voice is. But I lost the tab, so I hope the battery never runs down. Because it's the tab that goes between the battery and the sound thing. Okay, Scotch Break shipping tape. That's good. This was going to go into the jack o' lanterns. I need to put this back upstairs uh, because I ended up waiting till the last minute to get pumpkins and they were all rotten at the store. So I did not have a jack o' lantern this year. Okay, command strips downstairs in the basement, which is the kids playroom. Uh, I was hanging up their play clothes, like play dresses and vests and stuff, and I ran out of hooks. So I purchased them, but because of the parties coming up, I did not have time to put it on the wall, and therefore where did you put it? When the place you're supposed to put it is on the wall, but people are coming, so I stashed and dashed it in the utility room. So that will be gone. This is a bunch of gel pins that work halfway. I got it from like a real cheap, um, I can't remember the name of the store. 
but it's a store that sells stuff pretty cheap and half of these um, they work on and off but I keep them because my granddaughter likes to have fun with them I also picked up this notebook at the same time uh, looks like I'm going to have to remove a few of the pages oh, maybe not maybe I already took them out I'm just going to the edge because I'm not sure what pictures or stuff would be on here uh, never no, 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 no. okay so I have to go through this book but it will reside in this drawer I just have to tear the things out I would do it now but I left my camera stand upstairs and I am holding this this is the food that I got for my husband's birthday we had about 26 people coming or came because it's in the past but you know what this is a beautiful book but I am just gonna trash that where's my trash pile? and just get another one when the time comes because who knows what they're gonna change this is another notebook that uh oh my granddaughter put her like little turkey and then so that goes upstairs so of course I'm just piling up there I'll have to clean that off later my husband's hat and sunglasses which we do keep in this drawer the dot glue runner so why is this in here well my husband party uh, sorry sorry we're going through the dark it's well it's nighttime it's midnight to clutter I saw this on Pinterest where you make their um, gears you can see the seven and zero there and the 70 there you can see some of the pictures have come down but you just like overlap pictures over this is dollar store foam board you know it's very thin and you just put tape on it and then just like you know throw pictures up here there overlapping and it's very quick and easy to do and it was a lot of fun because you can put a lot of pictures on it so and then I held it up there with just that's just a command hook I purchased so these will be coming down tonight but probably not on camera but I will be pulling them down but that is why this tape runner was down here is um, in case like over here in case it started coming off I could refresh the tape so this is going back up in the craft room and that was probably more information than you were ever interested in but that's what happened so this just became the free-for-all more command strips or command hooks more command hooks those are those clear ones that I used to put up the 70s this uh, I'm actually gonna leave this out here not in the drawer though because I'm starting to bring out Christmas stuff and I have wreaths and I want to put one on the front door and one on the back slider the one I put in the back on the sliding door I put on the inside so that's that what do we got here we have a we have an envelope we have a dirty envelope because that's what goes in this drawer. I do keep a fire starting implement. Oh, look at look what I just found. I found the plastic thing to put in the Halloween thing. I will take that up and put it back in there because I want to save the battery as much as possible. These pads, I don't use the silicone hot pads very much, but I just use these over the um, Thanksgiving holiday when people came and I hosted and so we had about 26 for my honey's party and we had 17 people over for Thanksgiving uh, and uh, not this weekend but the next weekend we have a group of friends over so there'll be eight of us all together with my husband and a week and a half after that I have a different group of friends coming That'll be another group of eight. And so I haven't hosted any parties 
in my house since March, and now in a span of like three weeks, I'm going to be hosting four times, so. Oh well. I would like to host more often. I do enjoy having my friends over. So, what do we got so far? This, okay, I got this out of the toolbox for a reason. Oh, during the parties, the bags of ice were clumped. Some of the ice was clumped, not this brand. I'll show you. Okay. The city ice was fine, but I had picked up another brand from another store, which is in there. Um, yes, this is from Thursday and this is Sunday, and I have not pulled the stuff out of the melted ice water which I am going to do today after this video, because let's face it, I'm gonna have to do something, but like I said, I, right now I can only do something that I have my hands free on. The dump dinners I am still using and loving. I highly recommend that cookbook. November, this October, you can tell how, how recently I updated this. And November, I'm just gonna pull it off in December. And see, I saw got the group on 13. That's friends coming. And I am just going to pull off oh, this cute graphic and throw that out. So there's my 2018 calendar. Honey's, this is our spare handicap. And there is more paper to use. So I'm going to keep this paper in here. I am going to keep the 2018 calendar because we'll be using it soon. I am putting the, uh, this is actually a magnifying glass, comes in useful to have one down here. The eyes just aren't what they used to be. This actually goes to one of those things, so. Uh, November, this under, put this on top, I'm going to in the next day or two, make up my menus for the month of December. I would show you that process, but I'm still having trouble. Oh, that's my honey bun. That's my honey bun. 1957-1958 school year. He's such a sweetie. But that goes back upstairs. These are four crayons that I keep, but I don't want the kids grabbing them out until I watch them. I have a two and a half year old grandson that if I'm not watching will write on our white couches. So I keep the crayons in here so I know when he's coloring to pull those out. These, my husband calls them the soap dishes, but they're actually, you know, very heavy duty lights that uh, he has vision issues. So he needs the extra light when he like goes outside and goes to the car and stuff. This is to his scooter in the mailbox. And Alski, these are extra, uh, obviously, plug-in things. But I have a tree up, so it's taking one of the plug-ins now. And I keep spares up here in case, I don't know, sometimes sometimes you find a plug, is like, why is there no plug in there? So I keep a few extras here. So, and these are the felt pads that go on the bottom of the chairs. And since I only put felt pads up here where there's the hardwood floor, there's no point keeping that down in the uh, in the basement because this is the only place I use them. So what else do I need in here? I need my honey's hat and sunglasses. That light bothers him, so he has to have sunglasses almost all the time when he's outside. And writing utensils. And now this drawer is back in good health and all cleared out and all that stuff, like all the command hooks, the extra paper, the extra envelope, pictures, stuff to be thrown out, except for the groceries, which I will go back through and, you know, put back in the ones that aren't expired. This utility drawer has gone from junk drawer back to utility drawer. Thanks for watching one of my Midnight Declutters. Talk to you guys later. Bye.